Hi, welcome back to art class. I'm Lindsay Robb. I hope you had fun with the last still life. Today you're going to create a different still life. You get to use three objects that you're going to arrange in front of you. I'll show you a demonstration, but first let's look at some famous examples. Here are the three objects that I chose for my still life arrangement. So now that you've seen my three objects that I gathered, an apple, a pear, and a little cutie orange, I am going to draw those on my paper. I want to make sure that I draw them kind of the same way I see them. And I also want to draw and take up a lot of my page. So here I'm starting with the apple. And it's kind of far in the back. Then, right next to it, leaning against it, is the pear. I just want to pay close attention to the shapes I know to try to get it how I like it. Add the stem, and then the little cutie is right in front of the apple and the pear. So I'm overlapping. I'm not lining them up straight together. And then I can take my eraser and erase any lines. So now I'm gonna erase those pencil lines from the bottom of the apple and the side bottom of the pear because I cannot see through the cutie. Once I've done that, I need to be sure to add in my table. The table I have has a design or pattern on it with some stripes. I could go ahead and add those if I want to, but if yours is just plain, you can leave it like that. So now I'm ready to start coloring. I grabbed a few different colors out of my crayon box to start with. 